Hi, every hi everyone. This is Evan speaking. Uh, today, I wanted to show you all my list of programs. I've I'm kind of new at it, but um, over the fa past five or six months, I've pretty much developed a basic knowledge of it. Um, got this list. I'm going to show up right now. All right, here it is. So I've got many different programs. I've got an area equations. A, a fake one called Battleship, which I'll get into later. I've got Crush, which is a game. Distance, which is a math program. Do-it-yourself do game. It's really a simple shoot, but I can't rename programs. I've got Dodge. That's nothing I can get in trouble with, trust me. Um, foil. That doesn't work. Frogger X, which is kind of new. Midpoint, Memory. Pi, quadratic formula, Roman number conversion, that's that's pretty cool. I like this one. Look, check this one out. So you can convert between one and three thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine and you click enter to go into it. And like if you type in sixty-nine, no, never mind, I'm not gonna be inappropriate. If you type in one, you, everyone obviously knows one is I. And you should know the rules of how Roman number conversions, but if you don't, that's pretty sad. Anyway, three, they add you can go up to threes in pairings for like the letters, so three would be I, 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 but if you go into it and type in four, they do five minus one by doing the I, V, and that's how that works. So in the highest one I think is pretty cool, but it's not as long as this one I should show you. See, it's triple M, C, M, X, C, I, X, but if you go into this one, three, 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 it'll display three M's, three C's, or I don't know, I'll show you, look, three M's, three C's, three X's, and three ones. I think that's pretty cool. But if I could go a little bit higher, if I could go a little bit higher on the number, I could do three, 33,333, but it doesn't do that. All right, so going to programs. I've also got area equations. That kind of finds everything, like the area of whatever you want. Crush is a pretty fun game. The walls try and come in on you. And you have to prevent them from hitting you, so you just use the directional keypad to push the walls back. And I'm praying very hard right now, so it's kind of very hard. Hence the name. Okay, so go into do it yourself game. It's called Simple Shoot. It's really version of 1.2. So I've got high score lists right there. And I've also had I also have a half and half game. And open shooting. I think I'll show you the half and half real quick. So this is the graph up there and the home screen right there. It's using the horizontal. The horiz function, not horizontal from like drawing, but horiz. Use the up button and down button for corresponding directions and the right button to shoot. If you miss, if you miss, it actually will add a score add a score to miss, see? And if you actually hit it, it will add a score to two. Um if you get three misses you lose. And all these games right here, there is a home menu. I mean, not a home menu, but a start menu. So you click on it, you can click start menu. Go into continue game, quick game, new game. New game in this case, go into open shooting. This is new. I got a time of play, and it works very closely. It's pretty approximate. Um, 10, to 10, 10 to 20 seconds, my high score is 7, I think. Pretty sure. You don't get penalized for missing, but you will get a score after 10 seconds. God, it would put it up there. Oh, five. It actually does end itself. Um, I'll show you how to do how it works maybe later if you guys want to know. Um, here's another one I've made. It's kind of stupid, really. You've got these guys coming at you, and you have lives. You have to kind of dodge them. If you get hit, watch. Bam, lost the life. Bam, lost the life. Bam, game over. Um, it's kind of stupid. It has no purpose, really. Um, I have Frogger X. I think that's pretty cool. If you play it, it's it's not as good as it could be. It's kind of slow because I have a lot of things, a lot of if statements. If you know, if you're a programmer, and you know what I mean. See, look, I just made it there, and I really don't have to do anything. Like I, I can run past all these guys just like that. Watch, three, two, one. Just like that. It's not even hard at all. 
next game I have I have a guess number game. It's kind of cool. Uh, you choose a difficulty. This is not even funny. Like I don't even know who would do this. But if you're playing my game, if you click Eternity, you have, a guess, you have to guess a number between negative 10 million and 10 million. And it shows nines there, but if you add one to each one, or subtract one to each one, it'll give you negative 10 million and 10 million. Um, type in three, it'll tell you if it's too high. So obviously it's in the negatives, but there's a trick to the game where if you type in something, it'll you'll get it right every time, but we're not going to go into that. Next game we have, oops, next game we have Snake. Um, I can show you that later, or I'll, show, I'll just show you now. A lot of people have that Snake game where it only shows it in this top corner right here, just that top corner, and you don't run, in, if you run into the walls you won't die. But I think that's a very stupid game, and this game is much better. It's actually half a screen, and it's pretty decent, really. It makes the game much harder. See, I got a score. Now it's 10. And that high score up there, 1,085, that's not real. See, if you run into the wall, it's game over. That makes the game a lot more fun. I don't know why anybody wouldn't make a game that's more like My Snake. I also got Tic-Tac-Toe. It's pretty cool. It actually does work. It's actually very good, and that's pretty much all I have right now, but it's in, other than that, um, if you guys want to get the codes for this, you can go to my website, ticalcprograms.yolasite.com. I'll put it onto my more info underneath the video you guys are probably watching right now, but if you want me to just put it into a video, I can make it into a video too. I um, hope you guys liked it, what you saw. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks.